Hi, this is Alicia, one of the educators at Integrated Diabetes Services, and I wanted to share some little sort of diabetes life hacks with you guys. Um, I know in my diabetes management, it's not the big things that make a big difference. It's a lot of little things that just make diabetes easier. And one of the things I have found that makes my life a lot easier is figuring out how to hack my infusion sets. Um, if you're anything like me, you're probably a little bit of a diabetes supply hoarder. Um, I know I probably have supplies from my very first pump in the closet and then that, that old pump just in case as a fallback. Um, and so I'm gonna share with you today how you can use some of your older sets with your newer pumps or how you can swap out infusion set pieces and parts to make things work if you had a supply order that didn't come through or something happened you can't get supplies or maybe someone gives you a box of supplies maybe you get something donated if you're in need but it doesn't it's not compatible with the pump you're using um, so it looks really confusing we've got a lot of different infusion set options but when you look over this board this board represents the current infusion sets available from Medtronic and Tandem um, and it also shows some of the old um, inset Unimedical, um, the inset, the Comfort, and I don't have the contact detach on here is the one I'm missing. Um, and we've got an inset over here. Um, so you can see that our infusion sets really only fall into a few categories. We've got our angled sets here, and then we've got our 90 degree sets here. We've got our steel sets and our Teflon cannula sets. And that's really as far as the difference goes. Um, what I found really helpful is I went from a Medtronic to a tandem pump, but I still had all these Medtronic supplies sitting around. So what do I do? Or if I was in a, in a pinch and I need to Frankenstein together, hack together some sets, um, how can I do that? How can I make use of my old stuff? And I was shocked to find that like if you look at the True Steel, the True Steel from Tandem and the Sure T uh, from Medtronic, when you look at just the part that goes on your body, the infusion set itself, it's exactly the same. It's like plastic dot for plastic dot, the same exact thing. The only difference is gonna be on this end. This has got my T-lock connector, this one's got my Medtronic Reservoir connector. Um, the Unimedical are gonna have our old lure lock connectors. Um, that's the, the one that the tandem pumps used to use, the old reservoirs. But when it comes to the part that it's in my body, it's the same thing. So I can take my tandem tubing and my Medtronic tubing, and I can now use a Medtronic set with my tandem tubing and vice versa. I can swap it over, I can use my Medtronic tubing with my tandem set and make them work for whatever I need. Um, what then was even more surprising to me was say I have switched, say I used to use the Medtronic Sure T and now I use the Tandem Verisoft, one of the angled infusion sets. Well, those are exactly the same. So I can take my Medtronic Sure T tubing and use it in my Verisoft set. Or I can switch it around. I can use my Tandem Sure T tubing or my, uh, my Tandem True Steel tubing in my Tandem Verisoft set. Or say I have a tandem using Verisoft, but I have a bunch of these old Comfort Unimedical from when I used to be on my Animus. I can take, I can use the part that goes on the body for the Unimedical Comfort. I can take my tandem tubing and now I can use my Unimedical set all the way over to my Medtronic Silhouettes. They're all the same connection. So this, the Verisoft has this little angled shape and this little angled adhesive, but in terms of these connections, they're all 
the same. So I can swap those around and in a pinch I can make use of my old lure lock sets from my old Animus in my new tandem. Um, I just have to make sure that I have that tandem tubing and then I get it the right way. If you ever have trouble getting one of these sets on, uh, flip, flip your uh, connector around. You probably have it upside down. So again, this is the only side that makes these different. We can see the connectors for all three are very different, but the place where we wear it on the skin is the same. Um, the same comes in uh, our auto insertion sets. Um, so if we've got the Auto Soft 30 from Tandem or the old Inset 30s from Unimedical, um, if they come in this little kind of two-part auto inserter setup, they have the same connection. Again, you can see they're pretty much identical and they're completely swappable. Um, what I then found was I can then cross sets. I can use my tubing from my 90 degree sets. We saw that I can use that in my angled sets up here, it's compatible. It's also compatible down here. So I can use this, the same tubing for my True Steel, my Comfort Detach, my Sure T, my Verisoft, my Comfort, or my Silhouette. I can use that tubing with my Inset 30s and with my Autosoft 30s. So now I can have any one of a number of sets at home. And as long as I keep my tubing that is specific to the pump I'm using, I can use the, the infusion set from any of these companies. Um, again, this is great if, if you're you know, getting a, a um, donation from someone. Um, maybe you know somebody's grandfather isn't using their pump anymore and they give you a bunch of their old unimedical sets. Well, before you say, no, I can't use those, look, if, if it's any of these sets, you can reuse this tubing and use these together. Now, I will say the AutoSoft 30 and the Unimedical, so again, our sets that come in this inserter, these connectors are just the little bit, littlest bit larger you can see it's just the slightest bit larger than the other connectors um, from the rest of these sets. And so if I try to use the set from my Auto Soft 30 in say my True Steel, technically it works. Technically they do clip together. So like zombie apocalypse, do or die, yes, you can click these together. But what we get right here is this tiny little gap where the needle is exposed um, so the likelihood that you could potentially have something go wrong and it doesn't click really well. It's not really snug together. Like if I give this a good tug, it'll start to pull apart and separate a little bit, which makes me nervous. Um, of course this is, goes without saying that this is not FDA approved and not approved by any of these companies. Um, but like I said, in a pinch, it's a heck of a lot better than, than waste. Um, we know waste is, is something that we always try to avoid and um, you know it can save you a lot of money and it could potentially be life-saving if you're, you're caught without a set. Um, now coming over to the other side over here, we've got some of our other 90 degree Teflon sets. We've got the quick set um, from Medtronic. That is a standalone. That is, that only plays with itself. You can't really swap that out with other. So that brings us over to our, our last uh, 90 degree sets. These are 90 degree Teflon cannula sets um, that come in this sort of little hockey puck, hockey puck style auto inserter. Um, and they come in two varieties that you can see here. Um, you can see it most easily on these two. Um, we have the Medtronic Mio and the Tandem T90 that you can see the connector, uh, the connection piece from the tubing comes down and then there's this little clear plastic point. Then we have the inset from Unimedical and the AutoSoft XC from Tandem that has a large triangle and a smaller 
um, connection piece at the top. Um, so that means that these two with the larger kind of arrow shape here um, are swappable. And you can see it's kind of like blue on one side, white on the other, gray on one side, white on the other. Um, these are interchangeable tops that way. And then we have this set where we have sort of the larger colored piece and the smaller clear plastic. Again, our kind of larger gray and the smaller plastic. And these are kind of a funky shape. Not sure how, how well you can see that one. You can see the pink one um, much better. These have this kind of funky shape and they're interchangeable with one another as well. So you can't go Mio to Inset. You can't go T90 to AutoSoft XC, but you can go uh, Unimedical Inset to AutoSoft XC, and you can go Medtronic Mio to T90. You can swap those around. Um, and again, so what you, what you just need to make sure is that you keep the tubing that has the pump connection that you're looking for. And that way you can use up some old supplies, you can make use of donated supplies, you can kind of bodge things together and make it work in a pinch.